Bonjour. It's um, 6.49 in the morning. I tend to wake up about 6.30, eat my breakfast, usually with soy chocolate milk, and head up to the aviary to start testing by 7. It gets light at about 6 a.m. here, so um, testing the birds like soon after they wake up. They wake up is a good idea. Then we get a lot of their good morning time in before, before lunch. All right, it's the mid-morning break where we have to come back and recharge the batteries. So we have enough camera charge to record for the rest of the day. And also we'll take some more of the videos off the camera, put it on the computer, organize things, get a snack, recharge our batteries, and we'll be good to go for another session this morning before lunch. Well, usually in the afternoons, which is about 3 o'clock right now, I would be testing birds, but today is something different. I'm picking up my research assistant, Alexis Breen, at the Tontota Airport. So here I am. She's arriving in a few minutes and she's had a 24-hour trip from LA. She just graduated from the University of California, Santa Barbara with her bachelor's degree with honors. And so she was in her graduation ceremony. Three hours later, she was on a plane to come here. So she's dedicated and I'm looking forward to having her join me and we will be sharing the tent for six weeks so it'll be an interesting venture especially since last night was actually rained out of the tent and i had to retreat to the house so hopefully uh, we won't have another one of those events again and in the evenings it's all about the data so we copy data from the cameras to the computer back up all of the videos on the computer to the external hard drive and i have another external hard drive so we can have a copy of the copy so everything is saved and uh, we also, of course, charge batteries every chance we get. And here we have Alexis Breen doing one of the most common tasks that we do around here, which is cut meat for the birds to entice them to participate in our experiments. So Alexis, how does it feel being a recent graduate as of yesterday and now in New Caledonia studying crows. It feels amazing, although it hasn't quite set in yet, I have to say. Well, the long flight after that journey wears off. 30 plus hours. Ugh. It's very fun. Yeah. Okay. We are on top of a hill in a parking lot next to a uh, porta potty. There we go. <laughs> and we're here because we're accessing the internet. <laughs> internet bar has never been more exciting. It's true. Yeah, it happens once every couple of days. We get to, to communicate with the outside world and it's pretty amazing. 